Congratulations, Kelly. You one lucky man. Yeah. <laughs> that much I know. Thank you. <laughs> Good afternoon, everybody. Usually about this time, I'm pointing out the width of Mather Tower. Instead, the fates aligned. And here we are on this ship, surrounded by the magnificent city of Chicago, to celebrate the union of Kelly and Stella. And I understand this one's been a long time coming, so let's get right to it. What do you say? Now, I know you wrote your own vows, so uh, take it away, guys. <clears throat> okay, I can do this. Not gonna cry. Kelly, the simple truth is that you are magic to me. Whenever I'm at my lowest, you lift me up. You never leave my side. You are the goodest of men. And yes, we are taking a huge, crazy leap into the unknown. But we're doing it together. And when I need to hear it, you'll tell me you got this, Stella kid. And I'll know that everything will be okay because it always is when I'm with you. I love you with everything I got for this ever. And I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. <sighs> Stella, I decided a long time ago that if I was gonna be with you, I needed to be worthy of you, which seemed impossible. How do I become worthy of someone brave enough to show who they are, inside and out? What makes me this better person that I keep hearing about is you keep me from locking things up. Instead, you made sure you really knew me. And by some miracle, you still love me. So uh, I might never be worthy of you. But I promise to spend the rest of my life trying. I love you. I love you so much. Can we have the rings, please? What's left to say is, by authority given me by the state of Illinois and the city of Chicago, I now pronounce you husband and wife.